Hi, this is Chi with HGTV and we're back. This is episode four with Kyle Ban here with FC Ban and Son. Uh, last uh, episode, we were talking about the um, zip uh, sheathing wall system that uh, we put together here uh, for this house. Uh, now we're going to talk about the uh, the trusses and how they put the roof on the house. So, um, the roof trusses were delivered yesterday or the day before. Um, they deliver them in a big package on the ground, um, each individual truss marked. Um, I've gone through the whole house and taken measurements of all, all the wall dimensions and verified so when they build these trusses they fit on the framing that we have put together. Um, when they come, there's a bit of prep work involved before the crane comes. You take the end, get the end trusses, which are your gable walls, and you ply with them on the ground. It's a lot faster uh, to do it on the ground. And then anytime there's a ladder overhang, we, we try to fasten that onto the gable. And uh, there's other girder trusses that get nailed together, which are stronger members inside the structure. And once they're all ready on the ground, then when the crane comes, there's less time you're paying for the crane because more of the labor was done on the ground. All right, sounds good. So this kit will be all going, going up today. Yeah, by the end of the day, they all should be up. It's a long day. There's probably 125 trusses, I think. Oh, wow. Um, some of them get real small on the on some of the dormers and stuff that we can hand up, but the big ones you got to get with the, with the crane. Sounds good. All right, well, thank you so much for watching again. Uh, watch out for the next episode. Kyle, thank you so much. You're welcome. All right, and we'll see you next time.